guys welcome back to another youtube video and today i am showing you guys um something about minecraft legends you might have heard of minecraft legends it's like a new minecraft if you guys have played minecraft so let's get this video started i'm pretty sure we have like let's check um just to be sure so um let's head back onto youtube um library um so liked videos so i've liked one two three four four videos like cooking in fresh air oh advert sorry guys um flex oven. so we've got some videos to show you this is the cinematic trailer so we've got a little ducky so that's quite cute and we've got the little villager here oh look at that cute turtle not cuter than an axolotl though so the villagers just um hang out i guess on the countryside and then the villager is heading towards well the zombie villagers crawling towards him looks like he's about to attack wait what oh flower oh he's sniffing it nice oh, look at the bunny is that a never portal is that never portal's big huh? that poor bunny glitched like huh what's that and now we've got a little piglin He's like, come here, I'm going to eat you. I'm throwing it. <gasps> no, the bunny! Now they're looking at each other. All well, the mobs are like, oh my god. His hat's gone. No, his hat, his head's on fire. Run, run as fast as you can. Oh, we're inside the nether now. Oh my god. The nether looks mad. What is that? Huh? Okay. I have no idea what it is. I'm guessing it's the king. So we've got this weird fat guy. This weird guy who's riding a skeleton sort of thing. This other fat guy. Now there's a pickling invasion. Action, knowledge. Now there's a word. We must witness this together. Huh? That's a weird thing. Must witness this together. Hmm. So, what devices you can play on? Game Pass, Xbox, Windows, Nintendo Switch, PlayStation. That's surprising. And Steam. Now this is the PvP one. So it looks like you use the mobs to help you attack the castle and do all that. Having just a mass amount of units in. Hey, I'll just let the video talk. Building really cool bases. The original Minecraft has been out for over a decade, so you know we wanted to have something that felt familiar and yet fresh. Delicate balance, but I think we managed quite well. like that's the base so it could be your base could be anyone minecraft legends pvp in minecraft legends okay Dad. what's that caveman music so we wanted to try you place a flag and then your mobs attack like the or your teammates switch up you can tame mobs i'm pretty sure something then like a i think it's not kind of like the dogs like a strategy game with creepers in it. We definitely took some inspiration from some oh, other... Oh wait, the allies um, help you build stuff. Nice. I'm wishing Axolotl would help you build stuff. It's a bit of a remix of the story. It takes the kind of elements that you've learned through the campaign and allows you to kind of reuse them in different ways. The objective of the game is to destroy the other team's base. You have two different teams. You have a blue team and an orange team and each team can have up to four players on it. As the game progresses, okay. you can get stronger mobs and stronger structures to build. 
And these structures are interesting in that they create counterplay opportunities for your opponent. So say if two people are playing against each other and one person builds a new structure that increases their ability to command mobs, like they increases the size of their army, their okay. opponent can now target that structure and destroy it in order to remove that buff from the opposing team. There's probably a ton of strategies out there that, that players are going to do that we're going to have no idea. It's like me. Oh yeah, we didn't even think about that. I think the PvP component of Legends enhances the game significantly. With the you know, procedurally generated multiplayer maps that you get, it's like every playable experience is new and unique. We wanted to focus on a game that okay. was less about everything being exactly fair all the time and kind of embracing more of a chaotic fun element to the game. You know, the campaign has this procedural world and Minecraft in general has a procedural world, so we wanted to lean into that. And in the PvP space, the resources are, you know, you have to fight for them. So if there's only one... The diamonds in the, diamonds, the ground. Then in that well, on the top floor of the ground. Yes, yeah, so it'll be easier to get diamond the armor then. Because they want to get access to them. Guys, one sec, I'll let this video talk. So the resource gathering in Minecraft Legends is driven entirely by uh, allays. So the player basically says, this area here, I want you to gather me all the wood in this place of the world, and then the allays fly off and gather them all block by block and drop them into the player's bank. Depending on what you want to build... Sorry, sorry, there's redstone. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't watch it. You probably watched that bit, but I'm fine. So you can build your base. Looks like you drag it along um, and build like pillars. Start in a world where you have really easy access to redstone, and so you might pivot your strategy and go a redstone-heavy strategy in that case. Throughout all of that, the piglins are still in the community as well, so you need to watch out for other players, but you also definitely need to watch out for the piglins as well. You know, if you kind of ignore them, then they might uh, surprise you and attack at the wrong time. And we've had interesting games where players can kind of take advantage of the piglins' aggression and attack from the other side of the base. And yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a really interesting dynamic. There is so much space for creative expression and sort of going your own way. It's not just all about fighting. You can build your base, you can explore the world, you can battle the piglins, you can attack the other opponent. There's a lot of different things to do. And so I think that what we're going to see is a lot of players that enjoy different types of gameplay are going to find something for them in the PvP experience. So I think that's uh, really exciting. Okay, that is another video, guys. So we're gonna head back to um and head to the library. Bring in my bulb, and then. We are going to have a couple vanilla Minecraft uh, <sighs> legends, so you're going to see some familiar ones, the creepers, the skeletons, and the zombies. And then these are like the mobs, I'll show you. Golem, you. Mm. We are going to have a couple... You guys don't really need to see that. And then the rest are just going to... So yeah guys, and then th the other one is... liked videos and then it's like you might want to watch the gameplay trailer I did watch like a couple seconds of it well the piglins like come and attack your city and your villagers might try to run away Build barriers, spiny and zombie. That's a stone column, I think. Oh, well, that looks like a good nice. place. That's not actually gameplay. 
April 18th, 2023. Okay. Pre-order now. Yes, I will do that later. <laughs> okay, guys. So, um, I'm going to end the video here. And there's a channel you need to check out. Not just Minecraft channel. You need to check out this channel. Mm -hmm. Axel Gamer God. Best channel ever. So you want to head to this week. channel, mm -hmm. and then you want to watch every single one of these videos. You want to watch this yeah, video, nice. 69 views. Yep, nice, nice. I clicked off it. Guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. And our 400 subs subscriber of a special. We will do a Save the World Part 2. And this just goes on. So yeah guys, click on the next video and peace.